Welcome back to Titan Talk. I'm Devin with my guest, Josh, from football. Why did you start playing? Uh, Cause my mom and dad signed me up when I was like four. How old were you when you started? When I, I was four. What is the best part about playing? Uh, just hitting people and like having fun with your friends. If you could play any other sport, what would it be? Uh, probably basketball. What is your favorite pregame meal? The uh, chicken Alfredo we had a few weeks ago. <laughs> What's your favorite uniform combo? Uh, probably all white or all gray. How, how do you know when your coach is met? Like, he's got that look in his eyes. He'll start shaking a little bit. <laughs> That's when you know. Uh, who is your funniest teammate? Probably the whole line. It's all funny. Yeah. Who is your most motivating teammate? Davion. Mm. Who is the best athlete in your family? Me. Now let's turn to some rapid fire questions. If you could be great at any Olympic sport, which one would it be? Basketball. Mm. Favorite snack? Oreos with milk. <laughs> <laughs> what are you scared of? Bugs. If you were a superhero, who would you be? Superman. <laughs> uh, what's your favorite video game? Call of Duty. We'll be right back. This month, West Forsyth is inducting its first ever Hall of Fame class. Let's take a closer look at Derwood Pack. Derwood Pack was the West Forsyth Athletic Director for 22 years from 1986 to 2007. He was also the Assistant Athletic Director at West Forsyth from 2008 to 2014. West Forsyth won 107 conference championships, two state championships, and four state running ups while he was the West AD. Wow, what a career. Stay tuned right here for features on each inductee in the brand new West Forsyth Hall of Fame. Welcome back to Titan Talk. I'm Chris with my guest Ray. from eSports. Right, right. eSports is a sport that was uh, established five years ago, and this is the first time we're going to have it on our show. Can yeah. you tell us a little bit about it? So it's pretty much it's just like regular sports, but instead of being like on a field or in your room, and you just play instead of like physical and all this stuff, you play games that you really like to play, and everyone likes playing games, I feel like. So just getting a chance to compete for your school and getting to do stuff like that, I think is pretty cool. All right, so I heard our team's gone into the competition. Have we won any? Um, this is the first year we're actually having it. Last year they played the um, national, they're not national, they played state championships in Bank of America Stadium where the Panthers play, and it's uh, different championships for different games. Cool. So let's say someone was interested in joining, how would someone go about so doing that? So there's QR codes all around the school. Um, it takes you to this website. It's like five minutes maybe to sign up and then you got to sign up to, to uh, Discord which is where they like set up all like the tryouts and stuff like that. And you guys play a lot of games correct? Yeah. Uh, personally what was the hardest game you've ever played? Uh, like the two games of Rocket League I played. They, they were awful. I hated it. I don't like the game. And you guys have coaches that you talk to? Yeah so it's actually it's not, it's not like where you would go to gym and you'd see like a football coach. It's like actually off site, off campus, like coaches that come in and they help us on like calls and stuff like that. And what's your favorite game to play? Madden. I Madden. like Madden and 2K. Those are my two favorite games. All right. So who's your funniest teammate that you play with? Uh, I don't think he's going to play, but um, Braylon. He said he, he made a bunch of funny jokes, but if he's not playing Keegan, definitely. And we know a lot of successful people that do this for as a living, correct? Yeah. And so, would you plan on doing this after you graduate? Um, yeah, it seems fun. Uh, just getting to be with friends and getting to play games and win, win and it's stuff like that. I think it's fun. I think it's a cool idea. All right, so now we're switching to some rapid fire questions. What's your favorite snack? Uh, Oreos. Sing or dance? Sing. And your favorite class? Um, video design. And if you were a superhero, you'd be? Spider-Man. And what's your best dance move? Uh, the whip. The whip. And we'll be right back with Titan Talk. This month, Western Scythe is inducting his first ever Hall of Fame class. Let's take a closer look at Jerry Peoples. He was West Scythe principal from 1979 to 1996 and assistant principal from 1966 to 1968. He was the president of North Carolina's Principals and Assistant Principals Association. Worked with parents to create a strong support group called OK West that financially supported all sports at West. Wow, what a career. Stay tuned right here for features on each of the inductee and the brand new Western Side Hall of Fame. 
Thanks for watching Titan Talk. Views expressed on the show reflect the opinions of the host and guests only and do not necessarily reflect the views of the West Forsyth faculty or staff. Make sure you tune into Titan Talk every week. Click on the playlist to watch all of our episodes. Also check out our highlight videos of Titan Athletics too. For the latest news on West Forsyth Sports Marketing, follow us on X and Instagram at WF Sports MKTG. Thanks again for watching. I'm Chris. I'm Devin. And, and we'll, we'll see you back, back here next week. week.